Tatum touring every dorm at Babson College, including the best dorms, the worst dorms, a sorority tower, and more. Starting with where I lived my freshman year. All right, so we're going up to the third floor right now. This is what everyone would say is the Wild West. So this is my dorm right here. We're doing a dorm tour. What the? F Welcome to my room. This is uh, my roommate, Luke. What's up? This is his side, this other side is my side. I got a complete mess of a closet right now. I have my bed that I forgot to make this morning. You should make it right now. All right, this will this will do. It's fine. I got a nice computer setup going on. I got my monitor. This is like where I do all my work, and this is where I get like most of my studying done. Got all my cables over there. Got some books that I don't really read. We're going to Ryan's room now. All right, let's oh, go to Ryan's room. Let's go. Let's go to your room. Let's go to your room. Our room is really dirty. I'm kind of embarrassed. Like you don't really need to see my bed. Um, as we don't really make our beds, this is kind of gross. But this is my side. My bed isn't made. Um, here's my desk. We have an Xbox. But we have a a bottle that I threw up there a while ago. Here are my clothes hanged up. I got a lot of pants, some nice pants. Our room's pretty basic, not the most exciting room, but overall a nice living experience. It's a very nice vibe in here. So that was just Park Manor West, and we're on the outside now. And then we also have a building called Publishers right down there through the trees close to the road. And we're gonna go there now and visit my friend Olivier. Here we go. This right here is where all the magic happens. Nice, always clean. So first you're gonna start off the desk, sit down, Look out, get some work done. Gonna have your massage gun, cause you gotta get to the gym. Come on now. Then we have the babble bed. Don't wanna miss the babble bed. See, I'm a big guy, so babble bed is essential. You all know I'm a goofy. <laughs> I'm goofy, so I had to have somebody that represents that. Then we have Sleepy Hollow. Not a lot of people know about him, but if you're sleeping, go listen to Sleepy Hollow. This is where I usually read my book, Atomic Habits. This is my reading station. You know, I keep my little fake pillow right next to me, smile more. Love to journal as well. You gotta have some honey, you know, in case you wanna make anything sweet. Probably the craziest part about this building is the laundry room, you know, bad. It doesn't feel like you're cleaning your clothes when you walk in here, but these get the job done. How do you rate this room out of five? Um, out of five? If I'm being honest, I'll give it a five. <laughs> You thought I was gonna say three? No, it's a five. This is a great room, great vibe, um, very comforting. You have a lot of space. I also like to look at this. This is probably my favorite piece of art. At a retreat, people had to write nice notes about people, and these are all the notes that people wrote about me. What's your favorite one? This one. Your energy is contagious. Wish I could be as mentally strong as you. So yeah, that's probably my favorite note. Oh! <laughs> it's Obi-Wan Kenobi's. <laughs> Wait, I just was holding this. Am I dead now? Brian's like one of the oldest buildings on campus, I think. So this is my room. We got the uh, main living space area. So like when friends come over and hang out, we got like some decor with some leaves and lights. And we got this like nice cab jersey with the Polaroid wall with everyone who's come by. We have a really nice decorative door. It's decorative because it's actually not a door because it's uh, bolted. And right here is actually the kitchen, which is really cool. You get your own like normal size fridge. Uh, you get your own oven. The oven is like kind of iffy. So baking's a bit tough in Bryant. And uh, we have like a kitchen, like bar setup here. Right here is my PC setup. This is my PC that I built out of Craigslist parts. Secondhand, you know, sustainability. I got this Squishmallow courtesy of Cab on campus. I got a Darth Vader helmet. This is like my bed area where I sleep. We have of the lovely Baby Yoda or Grogu Squishmallow that my parents gave to me for my birthday like last year. So this is like super nice. It's also like good to just, you know, hug. One of my favorite things I will say is this MBTA map. It's just a really cool aesthetic, but also super helpful if you ever need to get around Boston. I also have a bathroom in here, which is kind of nice. It has like the shower and stuff. It's like pretty nice to have your own bathroom on campus. And like you only have to share it with like your own roommate. And for me, my roommate is usually off campus. So I have a place usually for myself. So. This is the best storm yet. <laughs> really? No way. <laughs> Hello, Colby. Welcome to my room. Yay. Can I have a dorm tour? Yes. This 
is my wonderful single in Coleman. Pretty big, you can come in. What should I show you first? There's so much. This is my bed. This is my tiger that watches over me. This is my like outer space wall. We have my tigers over here. They're also keeping me safe. And what's in this corner here? This is my corner that really resembles that I'm at college. Here we have a lot of laundry. We also have trash cans and just like bags of food that I'm hoarding. This is my skeleton. It just chills there to remind me to treasure my time alive. One of my favorite parts about this room is the view. My whole wall is windows and I get a perfect view of the fields. Perfect spot for selfies. It's great. What's your favorite part about the storm? I think the size of it. It's really big and it gave me so much potential for decorating it. I got to fill so much of a room. So many decorations. I know people say bad things about Coleman but my room in particular in Coleman is great. Overall, how would you rate the Coleman dorm out of five? A solid 3.3 .3 out of five. It's nice, but it's messy and chaotic and loud. The location is all right. It's somewhat close to everything, but there's this really, really, really big hill. <laughs> And I hate walking up the hill every day. I beg someone to drive me up the hill because it feels like such a big hill that's so hard to get up. This is the hill Cassidy was talking about. <sighs> okay, I don't know if you can still hear me, but I'm at the top of the hill. All right, next storm. Welcome. Can I have a tour? Yeah, sure. So I live in Woodside. I think it's like one of the only two dorms that has a bathroom in it. Here's my bathroom that I shared with my roommate, George. He just left to go get Chipotle. It's my closet. Here's his closet. This is my desk. Here's a Nintendo Switch that I won from a challenge that you did actually. So I'm very grateful for that. This is my bed. It's a twin XL. Here's a microwave that I'm not allowed to have actually. This is actually illegal in the dorms. What's your favorite part about this room? Honestly, my roommate is like pretty artistic, I would say. And he went to the foundry one day like, and he made this. He painted this. Doesn't this look like a real like painting? And I don't know, it's just like really artistic. I actually like, this is better than a lot of paintings I've seen in like art museums and stuff. If you're a Babson student, live at Woodside. It's, it's honestly a great place. I'd say that Woodside is probably top two dorms here. It's pretty dark out now. As you can see, we're at our last dorm tour of the day and we're right outside the Sigma Kappa sorority tower. I've never actually been in a sorority tower before. I'm pretty nervous, but I asked my friend Fru for a tour and she's down. Hey! Welcome to Sigma, specifically the Zeta Zeta chapter. That's really what matters. This is the kitchen tour, guys. Someone's cheese it, the trash. Everyone's moving out, so it's really packed. Anything good in that fridge? That's when it gets a little scary. Can't lie. Um, <laughs> this is our freezer. I'm pretty sure that spinach is mine. I'm never gonna eat that. You got a TV? Do you watch TV a lot? Yes. We watch TV all the time. And we also love reality TV. Personally, reality TV shows make me nervous. Like, it's a lot of drama for me in my heart. Woo! Hey! We had a sister. A cab, a cab sister. It's just crazy. What's your favorite part about the tower? I think it's a common room. I think I spend the most time here. Are you oh. living campus? Um, I'm leaving tomorrow, oh. but... Bye! I literally probably won't see you ever again. <laughs> <laughs> We all love Guy Fieri and we all love to eat, so it just makes sense. Now, we're gonna visit my room. Whoa! What's your favorite part of this room? I would have to say my lovely children, all my stuffies, they mean a lot to me. You got some unicorns? Oh, I do! Wow, I just really seem like the biggest sorority girl and I'm scared. <laughs> I swear I have a life outside of this. We had an event where we painted like My Little Pony figurines. We have a mirror. I do! And we got this bean bag. Yes! <laughs> Woo! That was so good! Ah, this is nice. I did notice that the bathroom is gender neutral. We tour the bathroom also. Let's tour the bathroom. <laughs> it says, an inclusive space for people of all genders. Wait, make sure no one's in there first. Hello? Welcome to the bathroom! You look amazing. We got a squatty potty. Yeah, here. have a pig for the real ones. Woo! Bye, oh, Peppa. I feed her right now. Oh, I'm so sorry. Should give you some shoes? So how do you rate this room out of five? Four. It has potential to be better. I love my bean bag, but you can't really walk in here. Besides that, we're doing good. We're done with the dorm tour. Hope to see you on campus. Bye. Woo! 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 Ooh! 
Like and subscribe.